Hi friends, so we are here in Chatsworth, California, which is the northern part of LA, Los Angeles. And uh, we just got in, and so I'm not gonna show my face because I look crazy. And we are here at the Holiday Inn Express and IHG Hotel. I'll put the name of the hotel, the, I'll put the exact name of the hotel in the description box. Um, but once you walk in, we got a king size bed um, since it's just the two of us. And here you'll see a refrigerator and a Keurig machine with a couple um, pods there and the ice, ice bucket. There is also a microwave and this is ours. We bought some um, apple tart for something that we're going to. And let me show you the room. Uh, let me show you the entryway. So over here you can see I have my suitcase there in my bag and there's a nice length wise mirror there. Here's the foyer. And I like that there's this little spot here where you could put your keys and your wallet and sunglasses or eyeglasses. You can even put your shoes under there or another suitcase if there are four of you here. And then here is a light switch. Not sure where that goes to. And so here's an overview of the room. Okay, and I mean, it looks exactly like the pictures that I saw on the website and Expedia, which is great. And then from the room, this is what the foyer looks like. And this is nice because once you're in the room or in the living room area here, the little kitchenette is there, the bathroom is over there. So there's a little bit of space. So you have some kind of privacy that way. And then here is the wardrobe. Okay. Oh, lots of space there to put. It's either like a, a bench for you to sit and put your shoes on, put your shoes under there, your suitcase, your suitcase, suitcases. There's some hooks there. Very nice. Very well laid out. And then you could put your uh, suitcases on top of here. If there's two of you for a king size bed. You can put a suitcase here, and this can be an, a section for you to sit down and then put the other suitcase there in the foyer. And then let's look here in the closet. So your uh, basics, uh, what you should expect is an iron, ironing board, an iron, and a safe. So I'm not gonna close this, but just kind of show you what it looks like there. Laundry bag, and so if you didn't bring like a wet bag for your dirty clothes, you can always use this and bring your dirty clothes home. A few hangers, not too many. Would expect to have a few more than that. Okay, let's close that. Mm, very nice. Okay, I'm not sure the size of the TV. I think it's a 50 inch. And then most of the more updated rooms, you'll see they have the different types of plugs already in some one of the outlets. Then lots of drawer space here. And one of the reasons I always use packing cubes is that most of the time the drawers don't have lining and who knows if they actually wipe the inside there. So I always like to use the packing cubes, not just to organize, but just kind of a liner between your clothes and the drawers if you choose to put them in there. Okay, here is the desk area and a nice ergonomic chair yes very nice oh look at this nice lamp very nice okay there's the light and then of course in the back oh you got the universal plugs perfect and my husband's backpack is there also lots of space okay and then the ac you can control then you have a little um seating area here oh nice big lamp Okay, and there are nightstands, floating nightstands on each side of the bed. This side has the clock and again, more plugs and then the sconces for your reading lights on each side of the bed. And I just love the decor here that it's very simple and modern. Look at the headboard with just the panels 
Nice color too with the walls. Oh, very nice. The bed feels really nice and soft and they give you two pillows each. Very nice. Okay, this is the view from our room. So you have the second building there, parking lot. Parking is included. There's a swimming pool, there is a jacuzzi. And there are, uh, it does come with breakfast in the morning. So they serve the breakfast, he said, and then you just have to bring it somewhere else or to your room. They don't let you sit in there, which is fine. It's a hot breakfast. And of course there's an ice machine and then there is a small gym that you would expect from a hotel like this. Let me go here in the corner to just show you another overview of the room. It's a great space, I love it. So glad that we picked this one and it had great reviews. Okay, let me walk over here to the bathroom and show you what it looks like. Okay, so there, the hair dryer's there, a bar to hang your towels. Um, this is of course the, the mat. They do give you lotion, soap, and I'm loving how they're doing a lot of the vanities like this where the light is around it. Okay, very modern. And I like the little pony wall to kind of have some type of uh, privacy, privacy with the toilet. Okay. Yes, a nice modern bathroom here. Okay, and then they have the shower the shampoo, conditioner, shower gel there. And there are some, there is a hook here. Okay, let's go in. Okay, so it slides, it slides. All right, let's open the shower door. My husband's entering the room now, that's pretty cool. And then you have the knob here, and then the shower head is there. Oh, wow, look at that. Oh, that is a huge drain. Okay, shampoo, conditioner, shower gel, J.R. Watkins, yeah, good brand. Okay, and then they still have another little shelf if you wanna put your toiletries there and another one there. Okay, so, hope you can see that. And then this is what the bathroom looks like from this side. She's preparing the food and putting it into a to-go box with silverware. Um, this concludes the tour of our hotel room, uh, Holiday Inn Express in Chatsworth, California, an IHG hotel. Hope you enjoyed this tour. Let me know in the comments below if you would stay in a room like this. It is, uh, the total came out too with taxes and hotel fees and all that to $200 about $193 per night. Let me know if you would stay here and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Hi, if you've made it this far in the video, I'd love to have you follow me on Instagram at Simply Sherry Travels for my short travel vlogs and things to do and places to go for your first time visits. Also at Simply Sherry Eats for foodie travel finds and local bites. You'll stay up to date in my stories and see behind the scenes. Hope to see you there.